Hello everyone, Supersonic Blue here, and welcome to another Red Dead Redemption 2 campaign mission here on the channel. So today what we're going to be doing is, we're going to stop here at camp and we're going to do this other mission with Uncle. Another one's appeared for Sadie, she said she'd be in Blackwater, so that's where I'm expecting her to be. So, just have a look, see, yep, there she is, she's in Blackwater. So what is this mission with Uncle then? Home improvement for beginners. Uncle needs to speak to you. Look at that, I am assuming we're destroying that shack. But who knows? Let's go chat to him. Ah, uh, feels like old times. <laughs> it's good to have the old gang back together again. Let's just hope things don't turn out like last time. There he goes. what I tell you, Charles? Boy is as sour as weak old milk. No wonder she didn't stay with you. Not even a retired two dollar whore would stay with you. That's the goddamn truth. Now you used to be decent company, but now you're worse than a snake with a toothache. All he does is whine, whine, whine. Excuse me. Oh, don't get all angry. It ain't gonna change nothing. You're hopeless. And I mean that literally. You got no hope. I mean, look at you. Look at this place. Your dream home. I've had better nightmares than this dream. Oh, darling Abigail, I've changed. Come live with me in an outhouse. I wouldn't ask my worst enemy to take a shit in. What are you trying to say? It's awful. It's a dump. The house has got to go. Get some self-respect, you miserable sack of shit. Build a house that a lady set foot in. The place just needs a woman's touch. It needs leveling. No woman would touch this place. Now, I reckon these horses can have it down in a minute. Here, come on. Tie that end around the horses. You loop that end around there. Horses will pull it clean down. <laughs> we good? I think so. All right. Well, okay. let's get going. So now we are... Just pull. Are we actually going to build a ranch? <laughs> oh. Uh, yeah. <laughs> See? I told you it wouldn't be no trouble. And now? Now we head into town, buy ourselves a house right out of a book. Same as if it were a bicycle. Where in town? Uh, there's a fellow by the train store. Cakes hardwood and timber. Okay. You keep working here. But if I don't go with you, who's going to tell you that? Just need a bit of peace and quiet from your incessant yapping. Charles, make him work. Whip him if you have to. <laughs> yeah, do it. Let's go, boy. Right. Hmm. Something over by the train station. Uh, unless we get close, I don't know. So we'll do this mission with Sadie. So I'm assuming it is another bounty. An honest day's labours. Plus there's a bounty there as well, so... That's good. $90. I mean, if that's dead or alive, that would be brilliant. Right, so let's go and see Sadie. Do another bouncy. See, look at that. Popped over that no problem like that last video of one of the last videos I did. Where I kept falling over stuff. Look, 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 look. Okay, he didn't quite want to go over that, but mind his stamina's a lot better. Like double. Okay. Okay, I need to lay off the throttle a little bit there. Okay. 
house. I'm assuming this mission for the house building will appear once I've done the Sadie mission. So I'll, I'll do that bounty at some other time. No. Nice saloon, this. Don't be causing no more work, work. boy. All right. Who says I'm gonna cause any trouble? Hello there, sir. Is this your first time in my saloon? Hello, Sadie. Oh, John. <laughs> Come sit down. Sure. You uh, got any work? Yeah. Well, there's always work. Whole country's getting robbed, robbing or stopping robbers. Well, seems like there ain't much else in this world except bastards, victims of bastards, and the bastards who want to put the bastards in the ground. And which are you, exactly? Me? My time. All three. But same as most people. I guess. Well, funny thing about this job, well, opportunity, I just might get to be all three again. How you mean? <clears throat> you ever heard of uh, Shane Finley? Cattle wrestler? Murderer, thief, child killer. He's wanted in five states. I caught him last week. He was disguised as a lady in a house for fallen women. <laughs> I was bringing him in, and I got robbed by a professional rival of mine, James Langton. Oh, he's a nasty bastard. I didn't much like him even before he robbed me. That happened a lot. This line of work. Yeah, but they're all people like me. Anyway, now they're holed up in the desert down south, waiting to head north so they can hand them in to the state troopers in the north country. I'd given up on the job as just a bad lot, but now that you're here, maybe we can go rob them back. Is cool. Money good? Yeah. It's real good. Plus, I don't much like getting robbed by no one. Come on. Where is it we're heading again, you say? Mm. South. Now come on, mount up. We got a ride ahead of us. Of course we do. Don't oh, that's Sadie's horse. That's a big horse. I really need hey. to look at its size of it compared to mine. We'll get ourselves a horse like that. Follow me. Let's ride. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Hey, what the hell is your problem? That new horse? Some folk buy ranches, some buy horses. Horses are cheaper. He looks mean. He is. A ranch? It's something else, you know. You gotta come up there. He ain't had any trouble. Some squatters, but that's it for the most part. That's good. Maybe these fellers I heard about have stayed north or gone off somewhere else or dropped down dead in their own tracks. It's good country. All country is good. It's just folk that are bad. You know who I got up there with me? Uncle. Besides Uncle. Abigail? Uh, Abigail ain't come there just yet. Really? You, er, wanna talk about it? Well, maybe, but Charles Smith. We found Charles Smith. Charles? He's alive? Yeah. He's doing okay. He was prize fighting in Saint Denis. Weren't seeming too well. He took everything real hard. But. I think life on the plains is gonna be good for him. I always like Charles. You send him my best. I will. You know, you can come along too. Build a cabin on the land. I've done that all before. Can't do it again. I'm on my own now, John. I, I ain't so good with people. Uh, the offer's there whenever you want it. That's kind. Unlikely to be taken up, but kind. 
You heard anything of Dutch? Nothing. You? No. You'd think. He's a colorful character. Word would get out. That's one way of putting it. Look, what happened with the gang changed everyone who was a part of it. The Dutch who put a blanket around me after the O'Driscolls, that weren't the same man at Beaver Hollow. And now, he might not be so colorful no more. You see a man whose character changed. I see a man who got found out for who he truly was. We were fools to follow him. I was a fool and I paid for it. And I was one of the lucky ones. Micah, John. Micah's the one who set it off. I blame me for following Dutch for too long, but I blame Micah for most everything else. He's out there. And someday, I hope we'll find him. But not now. Okay, there we go. Just waiting for her. You know, a cinematic type thing. So, okay. So, you've not been down this part yet. South. There's a spot up ahead where we can see over most of the country. They'll be down there. So, James Lang. So, where are we? So we're not much further down, so McFarlane's Ranch. Is that as in oh what was the name? Can't remember her name. She helped us in the first Bobby one. Hunter. You got this outlaw you captured in a women's boarding house? Shane Finley, correct. And we aim to have Langton give him back to us before he rides north with him to hand him over to some state troopers? Correct again. Though the giving back part is optimistic. You're gonna have to kill them I'm all, basically. The optimist. You know, I've been doing some bounty hunting of my own since I last saw you. I ain't gonna make a habit of it. We cut off we here. We have him, though. Is it Bonnie McFarlane? This is the place. It's Ooh. a view, all right. That's a big ranch. That can't, that must be a town. Come on, let's go take a look down in the valley. That's a ranch. That's not a, that can't be a ranch. Armadillo. Yep. I think this might be the Red Dead Redemption 1 map. Somehow. I think I see something. Yup. Ah, there. There they are, down there. Who's okay. who? Well, the bounty is the feller who's all tied up. <laughs> Very funny. And that big fat feller with the funny hat, that's oh, James right Langton. The other fellas just work for him. Where do you think they're heading? I don't know. Come on. Let's go follow them. Looks like they're cutting through the canyon underneath us. Let's go. I'm following you. So I heard a rumor that the Red Dead Redemption one map was in this. They'll be coming through here. So I assume that this is like a, like the start of the Red Dead one, before the events of Red Dead one, but after the events of Red Dead two, if you know what I mean. So obviously, we know that he was a rancher. Was all over that bloody place. You won't get north through here. What are you doing, huh? You you're talking to me or Langton? Sorry, I ain't used to having anyone with me. I guess it 
is they'll stop up ahead. We can get a better look at them. You know his thinking pretty well. Hmm? If you can't outgun them, you gotta outthink them. Okay, come on. The canyon opens up down a ways. We'll head them off there. Skid turns. All oh, right, okay. for himself how come he's got all them men and you work alone <laughs> i got you you're worth ten of them <sighs> great all right so what you think should we threaten them start shooting at him or sneak down and pick them off one by one Ooh. i reckon sneaking down is our best opportunity but uh, it's your call i would say sneak i'll follow your lead Let's sneak down there. Okay. Well, follow away. Stay down and stay close. Let's go. Because we're going to have to snipe him from up here, and I'm not the best <laughs> shot. Moving targets are bad, but when they're a small target, it's even bloody worse. Look out on these rocky paths. Ow! Running our points up then. Oh, up there, that's why. Oh, we got him. We got him in the old uh, leg there. Oh, I got that one as well. There you go. Good boy.
know we got. Gone nice and far away. What's it look like? Get him up there! Ugh. Come on! It didn't work out for you before, woman! You should let me alone! Down the canyon! Let's drive! Okay, let's go. Going. Come on. Need to relieve myself. There'll be a bucket in your cell. I'm serious. Yep, and so am I. Hit him, John, please. Hey, you don't need to do that just because she told you to. I don't need to be hit. I just want to be treated civil. Shut it. You heard the lady. Thank you. I still protest my innocence. This woman ripped me out of my bed, kidnapped me, then let Langton kidnap me, then. You killed them all and kidnapped me back. I'm the victim here. Damn you. John, would you be so kind as to shut him up? Pick, don't listen to her. No, let me speak my piece. There's no call to hit me, That's mister. Not. Listen to him squirm. Jesus. Bad dog. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. How do work ain't easy, John? No. But I this can looks see familiar. now it has its rewards. Just look at this quick. Oh, back in Blackwater. Uh, thought we were somewhere else. That's a whole lot easier with a partner. That back there, you didn't need a partner. You needed a whole company behind you. We did fine. And with Langton and his men gone, there'll be more demand for our service. <laughs> Sadie, you know I'm a rancher now. Mostly. And I know how you're paying for your ranch. Don't spread that around. Hi, I won't. But it would be good to have you along Here some more. Here we are. Grab him and bring him in, John. Sure. You're a bitch and a bastard. We brought in Shane Finley. Oh, great. Let's uh, put him in the cell. Hello there. I hate you. Yeah, you. you don't get out of here. That's 
your soul in there. To this. We're gonna watch you swing. What for? I didn't do anything. Nothing. Yeah, it's all yeah. Right. I thought you said you lost him. Well, I did, but we got him back. Oh, and James Langton's dead. We killed him. Why'd you do a thing like that? It was him that robbed me. Okay. Here. There's a decent price on Finley. Mm-hmm. I know. <laughs> you want this money to go to the bank, too? No, I'll, uh, I'll take it myself. <laughs> okay, Jim Milton. It's John Marston here. All right, well, if you need any more work, you can find me in town. Or maybe I'll find you. I'm retired. Sure. <laughs> Be well, John. Two hundred. Nice. Right, so. What? HL? That mission's still not available, is it? Bloody hell it is as well. Okay. Right, so. That's where we're going to leave it for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, please like and subscribe to my channel. Also hit that bell icon for future video updates like this. And I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.